So last Friday, exactly, I guess, few hours before Elon Musk uh, issued his warning on X um, to anyone who would engage in what he calls engagement farming would be suspended. And so this brings me to the reason why I'm filming this video, and that is basically uh, my speculation to why uh, Elon Musk issued this video just shortly after I have created an account on X and publicly posted a message to which I have tagged Elon Musk to. And this message is one which is bringing me to speculate why he has issued this warning to people as I am suspecting that he might have seen my message and this message is one which I have sent to not only Elon but also Mark Zuckerberg and intended to also send to Sam Altman if he was to ever accept my friend request. And so upon sending it to Mark and publicly tag Elon to this message which I've posted on my newly created account on Friday, um, I was hoping to get the attention of, of any of those three people who I thought would be uh, important to reach out to due to the importance of my message. And this message is one that might appear a little con unconventional to most, especially coming from someone who does not have a background in uh, tech, uh, but rather in baking or massage and even acting and book writing, all sorts of creative departments aside from the tech field. And so this message is the following, which I am now going to read to you because this will clarify why I am speculating that Musk has purposely issued that warning um, after having read my post. So the message reads as following. Hi, Mark. Well, in this case, it is Mark because I sent it to Mark to uh, the message to which he um, did not reply to nor open, I believe. Or did he open and not pay attention to it? Either way, um, he did not have any reaction to the message, contrary to Elon Musk. And so I continue. Hi, Mark or Elon. I admire your leadership and active involvement in being at the forefront of the AI race. I would love to share with you a system I have taken nine years to conceptualize that may secure you the leading role in emotional intelligence AI before the world catches up to it. Hope this short pitch catches your curiosity and hope to talk to you soon. Have a great day. This message, which I have also intended to send to Sam Altman, if he ever um, decided to accept my friend request, which would be very unlikely due to the fact that, uh, for one, I am a nobody who has very low follower count. Um, and also, my feats are pretty much just remixes of other people. So that would even... Um, I would even make it so that Elon, someone like Elon, would very unlikely answer to um, such a sudden public post um, due to, for one, its nature being what it seems like engagement farming. And to those who do not know what engagement farming is, uh, let me read to you the definition which you can find on any articles that, that, that speak about the incident and so allow me to open this article which I'm going to read to you at this very instant about engagement farming because engagement farming is something that he absolutely bans on his site so it goes as follow in a post up on X Musk wrote any accounts doing engagement farming will be suspended and traced to source so the post generated immense response 
and many users hailed Musk's latest announcements. So if this means suspending accounts that consistently re reply to large accounts spamming unrelated content, that would be amazing. I miss when replies were in response to the original post, uh, wrote one user. So what is engagement farming? So the following explains it as such. In simple terms, engagement farming is when one wants to get more engagement on social media platforms. For example, this can be done by participating in multiple Twitter spaces at once without adding any specific value, but only to pump one's bag. The method is used extensively by users to get more followers, likes, comments, and retweets on social media platforms and grow their personal brand. So uh, who are the users? It's a common practice among influencers to join groups consistently, usually of up and coming influencers to engage with each other's content in a reciprocal manner. Whenever one member of the group publishes a post, they share it by a messaging services. So, so seeing it that way, it seems like my Instagram is totally about <laughs> something I realized on the spot while filming the video. Well, this does not contribute to my credibility, does it? Which stands beside the point. The point is that I was not doing engagement farming on X platform, not at that instant, at the very least, because my sole purpose on reaching out to Musk was, uh, well, as you have heard in the message, and if you have not heard the message yet, well, let me again read it to you to make it clear that what the message was truly about. So, I admire your leadership and active involvement in being at the forefront of the AI race. I would love to share with you a system I have taken nine years to conceptualize that may secure you the leading role in emotional intelligence and AI before the world catches up to it. Basically, I've spent the last nine years conceptualizing a system that uses AI theory uh, to quantify human emotions. And so, not only emotions, all things energy in the world, um, in fact, but um, because of its um, peculiar nature and uh, the claim I'm making, such a bold one, uh, that being able to quantify all things, especially something of, of a nature so abstract as emotions, it is very unlikely for someone of um, a background who just uh, not in the tech industry with an Instagram account uh, that constitutes mostly of engagement farming videos. Um, very unlikely for someone as intelligent as Musk to uh, consider uh, anything more than trollery of my account, which therefore explains why I have received none answers from the two others, but only a reaction from Musk, which is again um, brings us back to my speculation uh, that um, his. His warning was prompted after having read my absurd little reaching out request, which he has probably dismissed as a spam account or someone who just wants attention, which is in that very moment anything but that. And so I thought that it would be an interesting story to share, again, not as an engagement farming video, although that seems like that's all I, I, I seem to be doing with whatever I'm trying to do. But if this does work as a second attempt to reach out to any clever ones, uh, smart ones who thinks outside the box, who understands and sees the value in what I just spoke about and has followed all along, all this time, then you might clearly see that I speak soundly and with a, a mind that thinks uh, clearly, not only clearly, but also deeply. Um, and capable of, 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 of deep analysis and the type of thinking that might be very uh, uncommon to a lot of people out there as I would often consider my thinking type to be leaning towards the or rather entirely of the neurodivergent uh, department and so I am able to connect dots where everyday kind fellow men would not be able to would, would miss or, or dismiss because their um, inapparent uh, connection. The reason why I'm also hoping to do this is because I had of my own uh, dreams and ambitions to have an AI tech of my own using the system I have created, but having no background in tech, but being solely inspired by the vision of, of, of walking the steps that Jack Ma walked with uh, having only but a uh, real heart, a head full of dreams. Something of such a magnitude could could be possible because only of one person's uh, strong will and vision of the future. But I do hope as an optimistic person, uh, as an optimist, to be able to reach someone who does see the value of my, my, my dreams and to be able to take my system to the next level where 
I could help whoever it is that will want to lead in the next 10, 15 years the movement of emotional intelligence before it has even taken place. Because if there's anyone who can quantify emotions, that would be this person right here who is working as a night baker. Very unlikely uh, candidate. But believe you me, if there's anyone who knows how to quantify emotions, it would be this person right here. And this person right here has to unfortunately go and work with bread because the world does not see the values of my thinking mind, which I have often compared to the same thought process of artificial intelligence. Because however, however AI works, I have confidence that I am able to understand its process. Perhaps because uh, my brain and the way I, I connect information is not so far different. Uh, or maybe perhaps we are all not so far different from AI. Or perhaps I'm most aware of this, of this similarity. And therefore I have chosen to walk down this path of quantifying emotions. And so hopefully this video reaches out someone who likes someone who babbles um, their thoughts out loud like this. And if you ever bump into Elon Musk, please pass the message that I was in no way trying to do some engagement farming, but rather uh, genuinely hoping to reach out to him or to anyone else at the forefront of the AI race if it is not taken care of now by those in power. And I'm speaking of individuals who I hold in high regards, then I am not sure in the future if it would be in the right hands. And this is the whole reason why I'm making this video. So that is that. Thank you for watching and have a great day.